How's it going, everyone? My name is Do Girl, and welcome back to Throwback Thursday. Last time we left off, we uh, had some problems with uh, Patchabelle's cannon, but we got where we needed to go, and we did what we needed to do. Now it's on to sitcom. We're just about ready to turn on the far vision. I'm not sure what we'll see, but you should prepare yourself for the worst. If the picture isn't clear enough, just wiggle the antenna on top there. Okay. Ugh. Finally! We're getting something on the far vision! Let's see if we can see what our little spy can see. That's a mouthful. <coughs> I'm surprised it works. My lord, we have combed the fortress's upper levels but have found no sign of the intruder. Who would dare invade our fortress? My fortress. Dracath. There is only one person on war who would dare risk my wrath. Tristina will pay for this insult. He looks so tired. What do you think Tristina was doing? An assassina assassination attempt? No. Tristina knows that she could never get to me. I have no doubt that it was to some ill-conceived plan to spy on me. The hero left too quickly to have learned anything about our plans to invade Popsbrocket with your undead army, destroy the Cyclone army, and seize the energy orb by force. Sorry. Then she must have left something within the force. Maybe some sort of device, like a machine of some sort that the so the that the hero could attach to one of the minions. Yes, something like that. Um, something that the hero might have attached to, say, a flying eyeball. What are you prattling on about, Dracath? My lord, I believe I have found the spy behind you. Dracath, you idiot! This was flying behind me the whole time you were describing our plans? Yes, my lord. That didn't strike you as a little odd? I will catch the spy. Just don't kill me. This is great. Do we have any popcorn? I got him. Don't worry. <laughs> I got it. I got it. I don't got it. Stand aside, Dracath. I will capture it. Okay, I gotta get a hold of myself so I can do the characters properly. <sighs> well done, my lord. Those things are. <laughs> that be a lesson to you, Prince of Fools. And as for you, it does not matter that you know my plans. In fact, I invite you. To try and stop me in my undead army. Oh, oh, poor little hamster. Is that a coffee machine? I have been forgiving you so far, Tristina, but that time is over. Long live the shadows. Lugnuts! He destroyed the mini magic eye, but it worked! Yippee! Try to focus for a second, Yix. We, we learned what we needed from that loudmouth, Dracath. Sepulture was bringing war to Popsprocket. We have to do everything in our power to keep him from getting the energy orb. We can help you get around Popsprocket, but we don't have the numbers or resources to fight a war. The other heroes of Falconreach will come to the aid of Popsprocket, but their numbers simply won't be enough. We're going to have to find an army somewhere. Where? How? We barely have enough gold to feed ourselves, much less hire an army. All we have access to are warehouse after warehouse of empty boxes. Ding. Hmm. That may be all we need. I'm going to need to borrow one of your griffins. 
<laughs> yeah, uh, that's what I was thinking too. Okay, uh, if I can find a Bible verse about helping others in need, I will put that at the bottom of your screen. But I will say, uh, coming up Friday, uh, I have a special episode of one of my absolute favorite games, Bioshock. I'm, I'm finally, uh, thanks to uh, Steam user Fox for the, the, uh, for the gift of the Bioshock game. So thank you. So yeah, be on the lookout for that Friday. Oh, I'm getting a headache. I really hope it's not this. Anyway, and I'm getting sleepy too. Kind of had a bit of a mishap this morning. Um, I won't go into details, but uh, yeah. Rents are kind of pissed at me at the moment. Hey, I love making my parents mad. I forgot what I wanted to say. Budge. Oh yeah, um, hopefully my parents aren't too mad at me, so, ouch. Wonder what's in there. Gotta get this pa past this guy to find out, so. Yay! Progress incentive. Okay, okay, mystery bag, what's in you? Uh... <laughs> Okay, yes. <laughs> oh, it did different sparks, too. Oh, boy. Okay. There was nothing in the bag. It was the bag. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Got that fixed. Um. Whoa. I honestly have nothing else to say right now. Wow. That's got to be a first. And for the record, I really hope I'm knocking these guys out and not killing them. Because that would be kind of bad for Sneevels to be knocked down so many numbers just for a request for box, uh, just for an offer for boxes. Okay, that was a little more difficult, but still easy enough. Next. Here we are. Oh, figures. Wow. For a lot of boxes, they certainly do know how to, how to decorate a room. Okay. About to say, I really hope that ain't the final fight. Okay, uh, sorry I've been sounding a little lackluster. I've just been really, really tired, uh, due to the in, in well, mainly due to the incident this morning. And, uh, yeah. And plus a panic attack shortly after, so, yay! Mental health for the win. Okay, let's deal with this guy. Okay, I think these are going to be the last three, so go ahead and talk through it. And do that. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, they also, I wanted to show this off too. In the options screen, uh, you can do like manual pet actions. And you can feed him too, look. Well... I don't have anything to feed it with, but I'm sure they'll fix that soon enough. Let's go with this. So yeah, it definitely helps to uh, it's one it it gives it another it's another option to use. So stun. Thank you, Sparks. Okay. <laughs> I'm surprised they don't have like a burping sound effect when Sparks does that. I guess I can add one myself, but oh well. And they've been up updating everywhere else in the game. It's amazing to see how old everything looks. You know, it's just wow. In the update, did these guys get left behind or what? I guess nobody really bothers with the old quests anymore, so they just don't feel the need to update, I guess? I don't know. Okay, buddy, finish him off. Thank you. Uh, yeah, do fury. Uh, sorry. Uh, 
like I said, I've been up early this morning with the uh, incident this morning, so yeah. Yay. Panic and fear for the win. Okay. And let's kick it off with a bang, shall we? And there we go. Maybe another drink, excuse me. <laughs> a little scribe. What you wanting? Other than breaking more of Sneevel's stuff. King Sneed, I have come to ask for your help. What? You just knock out lots of lots of Sneevels on your way here? Now you want help? Uh yes. You need buy a book on asking politely. Or shrink. I have noticed that you have command a great army of Sneevels who will fight bravely, and I am willing to pay you well for your services. Now you speaking my language, but we no want you gold. Who said anything about gold? I can give you boxes. A hundred thousand boxes. A hundred thousand boxes? Nibble face! Yes, King Sneed. Is a hundred thousand boxes a lot? Yes, King Sneed. Hmm. More than five? Yes, King Sneed. We do it! Okay, make done quest. <laughs> Sneed agreed! <laughs> you have got the beginnings of an army, sort of, but that will not be enough. Maybe some of the Pact of Knights can help you. I hope so. <laughs> More than five. <laughs> I forgot that Sneevels aren't good with money. With, uh, or with uh, counting, rather. Okay, that was it for this week's Throwback Thursday. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, please like and comment down below. I really appreciate it. Take care of each other. God bless you all. And I'll see you all later. <laughs> well, every army has to start somewhere.